y'all so in this video um i am already started braiding um my hair down for the crochet braids um for the crochet um installment um as you can see i've already started braiding it down um showing you guys the back the process it's not all even, but ain't nothing going to be perfect. So, um, my audio got cut out and I am, um, basically doing a voiceover. So you guys will see the process. Um, right now I am showing you guys what I'm using to, um, do my, um, hair with. And y'all, make sure you guys get that wow hair growth. It is a very good oil. So, this is the hair, the crochet passion twist that I'll be using to install my hair with. Um, I like it because it was different. It wasn't like everybody else's. And right now I'm just showing you how the curl pattern is and how tight the twists are. So right now I'm going to start the process of braiding the hair. So right now I got the weave and I divide it in three pieces so that um, I can grip it a lot better. So as you can see in the video, I am about to show you how I braid down my hair. And y'all, about my nails, <laughs> y'all, I am hanging on <laughs> to the bone. Um, I just rather spend money on something different than trying to get my nails done right now. Um, so if y'all just see my little two little nails, please don't laugh at me. <laughs> it's normal. They fall off. You got to get them redone. But right now I am braiding my hair. And y'all, I braid tight. <laughs> so if y'all see me close my eyes, y'all, that mean that I am pulling my brains. So right now, I am braiding it to the back. I am showing you guys how I braid my hair. So if you guys want to just go ahead and watch this process. y'all them braids be tight y'all i'm sure you guys can see <laughs> but this is what i'm showing you guys i took the tail from the second braid and i added it in to connect it y'all please don't look at the back of my head um this was a quick process that i was doing And that braid right there, I braided it all the way down um, to the back of my head because when you install the crochets, it doesn't pull. Um, and plus, it won't give you a headache. That way you can pull your hair up and put it in the ponytail if you want to. And you don't have to worry about it having the crochet look. So right now, I am going to let the music play and let you guys see the process that I am taking as far as how I do my crochets and um, every detail.
Hey you guys, I am back. Right now, as you can see, I have braided down my hair. Get close to y'all. Y'all don't mind the back. It's in construction. <laughs> but I have braided down most of my hair. I have left out the last braid for you guys. Um, so y'all can see the process of how um how I do my hair before I install my crochets. I always put some China Jam on the sides of the hair just to help the freeziness stay down. Okay, and then I take the edge comb and then I just kind of like glide it through. And y'all, it don't take much weave. Like, you just cut some weave in half. And you just, um, you just do what you gotta do. You know what I mean? Like, you don't have to take as much hair to braid down. Um, you don't want your braids to be looking all poofy, lumpy, and whatever. So, y'all see these two tails? Those are going to get taken care of in just a moment. You're going to watch them disappear. <laughs> so, I'm going to hush and I'm going to um, get this last braid, braid it down. Now, the process again, I um, take this and I kind of split it with my finger to make three parts. Y'all see these? Three parts. Okay, and then I kind of comb it down a little bit so it'll be even. So, right now, I'm about to braid my hair. I know y'all getting tired of me talking. Oh, no, that's not right. That's not right. Oh, y'all, this weed is giving me trouble today. Maybe I'm gonna have to just take a little piece, just start breaking that down, and then connect. Things are not perfect, you guys. There is a process to everything. Okay. Show this way. And y'all, I braid tight. So if y'all see me close my eyes, I'm just trying to uh, hold in all the pain. You know, beauty is pain. It takes a lot doing your own hair. It really does. Like, I'd rather do my own hair than to ask someone to do it for me. Since I'm licensed and I know what to do. I'd rather do it myself. Okay, so y'all. This is where... Now, I done got to the ending almost the ending of my my braids so this is where i'm going to start to connect those tails that y'all see back there connect this one and then i'm gonna connect this one i'm gonna pull it tight as i can get it 
Okay. All right, so y'all see, and y'all, I'm just going to take a little bit of this shiny gem. I'm just going to like push that up in there. Nobody will see it. Trust me, don't worry about the back. So, here I got the tail. Okay, and y'all see the back of my head. Okay, what I'm going to do is take the crochet needle. I'm going to just go into a random space, hook it in, close the loop, pull it through. Y'all see how it blends in? I'm going to move my hand so you guys can see it. Okay, and then I'm going to continue that process until this part is gone. As you guys can see, all the tail is gone. The tail is gone. So, I will be showing you guys the finishing process. I'm sorry, you guys. I had to go fix, um, fix something on the thermostat can't really hear with the air conditioner but excuse me for that so now that I'm done with the whole braiding process what I do is I go back with my wild hair growth and I go back through and I just put oil in the spaces of the braids So that way the hair won't dry out I just rub it on through rub it on through you guys don't worry about your edges just yet and then I take the pump it up and then I just spray it on the top of my head so that way it can have a firm hold okay so the next step you guys will be seeing is the installment of the crochets. And um, this is how it comes. And what you do is just pull it on off. See? It's that easy. okay so it also has a loop so I'm just gonna go through here it has a loop as you guys can see all right so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go at the bottom which is at the rim of my head and I'm just gonna start installing Close the flap. 
and then you take this part, the end, then you connect it, then you close the, the loop, then you pull it right on through, you just pull it. There it goes. And if you guys need to see it again, I will do it again. Here and it's tight and there it goes all right and you just keep the same process throughout the rest of the process um, so you guys I'm going to take a break and I'm going to go ahead and crochet some more hair in and I will be coming back to you guys when I am almost done with the crochet process so stay tuned can't wait for you guys to see the finished product hey you guys I am back so um I have got almost finished with um, the crocheting process so you guys can see how natural it looks I'm going to show you guys the back. I'm not done with the back. I'm going to show you guys the back of it. The texture of it. How it's looking. And um, I'll be back to show you guys the finishing process. So, be patient with me you guys. And I'm going to get you this video. <laughs> 